Over 5 million children in the United States are impacted by a parent or caregiver's cancer. At Florida State, some students know about these experiences all too well. Junior Emily Leto was one of many affected by this sobering statistic. My dad was diagnosed with cancer when I was eight years old. Um, it was grade three brain cancer. And so that was very scary. Um, and not a lot of people understood what I was going through. Then uh, lightning struck twice and my mom was diagnosed with breast cancer when I was 15. And so going through those situations were um, terrifying. And a lot of times as a kid going through that, you feel alone. At FSU, Camp Kesem exists for students like Emily. This organization is compiled of student leaders who take initiative and work towards creating an all-expensive paid camp during the summer for children in North and Central Florida. And um, now my parents are cancer survivors, and so I am here at FSU in Camp Kesem able to use that experience. Although Emily did not participate in camp when she was going through these hardships, FSU senior birdie, Marin Douglas, was able to. I knew that as soon as I got to Florida State, I wanted to be really involved with Camp Kesem just because it had such a powerful influence on me as a kid. So when I think of Kesem, I think of home. Students at Florida State spend all year fundraising to take the burden off students and their families who suffer from cancer. From share at nights to Halloween candy grams, members of this organization put their whole heart into everything they do. We spend that whole year waiting for that one feeling of stepping foot on the campsite and it's just like a switch. Like we become totally and completely ourselves. Camp Kesem is one like no other. The, I think of home because I spend all year waiting for that moment where I can go back to camp and be with the campers and give them that safe space where they don't have to necessarily directly talk about why they're there, but they can still know that we're all there for the same reason. And it's just, it's literally this inexplicable feeling of love and community. Being involved are rewarding in many ways. While the COVID-19 pandemic changed platforms of camp in 2020, Counselor Sunny still gave it her all. So I have been to two in-person camps and then last year we did a virtual camp called Kesem at Home. And there really wasn't any difference between the in-person and virtual camps. The magic was still there. You still got the connections with the campers. In person or at home, relationships are rewarding throughout the Camp Kesem organization. Camper and counselor Sunny has a passion for helping those in need. Being a coordinator has really allowed me to establish myself as a professional in the Tallahassee community, as well as just um, allow me to grow professionally as well. I'm a tour guide for the university, so I was able to make connections with other families that way, and it really just pivoted me towards a certain path in what I want to do. Growing up, I always knew whatever job I was going to end up at, I wanted to help people in some capacity, and now I know I can do that through my experiences with Camp Kesem. Growing into different careers and passions, each student describes Kesem with love. The best way to describe it is just like that overwhelming warmth feeling. Camp Kesem means magic to me. It's changed my life. Camp changes lives. As Camp Kesem continues to make a mark on kids around Florida and the nation, it also touches the hearts of every FSU student involved. I'm Abigail Watford, reporting.